Don't block me with your rock hand. I won't. Most kids their age spend their days in school with activities and friends filling their afternoons. Have you seen Phantom of the Opera? No, I haven't. But for Ava Briglia and Jim Kaplan, a normal day usually ends with a company bow. Being on Broadway is probably the most amazing thing that I've ever experienced in my entire life. You're in the band. They're not even in middle school and already have impressive resumes. I was in Matilda on Broadway, also School of Rock on tour. I did King and I on Broadway, and I also did the Matilda National Tour. Ava's hometown is in Pennsylvania, and Jim is from Roslyn, Long Island. Oh, hey, that one's that familiar. familiar. They both live in the city with their moms while they're performing and have private tutoring. My mom teaches me, but then on Wednesdays I have tutoring at from 9.30 to 12.30. Ever since first grade, I've been in a cyber school called PALCS, and it has a really flexible schedule. My teacher posts lessons, um, and I have classmates too and a teacher. It's like real school, but on a computer. Both kids recently joined the show, with Ava taking over the role of Summer and Jim plays Lawrence. In the beginning, he's a little shy and awkward, and then when he meets Mr. Schneebly or Dewey, um, he becomes more confident about himself. My character, Summer Hathaway, she's a feminist, she, um, she's a strong character, and she stands up for women's rights. part in School of Rock is probably the end where we're all playing um, Stick It to the Man Encore it's because that's really fun and I get to dance in that one while playing the piano. I like Teacher's Pet and oh I like um, You're in the Band when I'm the manager when I go back to my desk and I get my clipboard and I'm like rocking out. On the day we caught up with them they were prepping for a performance of Stars in the Alley. When I saw Mean Girls and Hamilton and Dear Van Hansen, I was shaking at the stage door. I was literally shaking. And I feel the same way that she did. Like she, I saw people that I've seen in shows and I was like, oh my god. Like, um, we have to go get ready for the performance now. See you after the show. Bye. Bye. Already professionals, they know they're giving up a so-called normal childhood, but wouldn't trade it for the world.